I was scared at first because I never liked him near me. He liked to isolate me a lot. He didn't want me to make friends at work. He didn't want me to go to go drink with them after work or just to hang out on the weekend. He was always drunk. I told him, I'm afraid of you. I am afraid of you. And I thought that was the last time that would ever happen, but it wasn't. I had no emotions. Mm -hmm. When she, I would hear my father's voice coming home from work, mm -hmm. that I would hide even before I could walk. I was quiet. Mm -hmm. I was withdrawn. We couldn't share with anybody. I had no friends. I don't give up. Allow people to help you that want to help. I think it's so eye-opening to, to work somewhere where you're seeing so many things happening within your community that if you're not really entrenched in it, sometimes you can overlook. Uh, my name is Cheyenne Northcutt and I am the Community Engagement Coordinator at Safer Path Family Violence. We offer services to victims of domestic violence, sexual assault, human trafficking, stalking, and teen dating violence. All of our services are, are free to our clients, and that includes our 30-day safe shelter. Uh, we have eight bedrooms and 22 beds. We have a hotline. We have crisis intervention, legal advocacy, um, and many more just depending on what our victims need. It's sometimes case to case. This affects every single person. Um, statistically, it's one in three Texans that experience domestic violence. We like to say that it's one in one people that are affected by domestic violence because whether it's you as yourself who are a survivor or victim, um, a family member, a friend, a co-worker, someone that you know um, this has happened to, you can contact us via our 24-hour hotline, which is 830-569-2001. We also have a um, all social media, our um, Instagram, Facebook, we have a website, so you can reach us via any of those options. The core value of ours is we're client-centered. Everything that we do, every decision that we make, that driving factor behind that is our clients. Um, we Every decision that we make going forward and the services that we continue to add and as we grow as an organization. We, it's always with our clients in mind. We do what we do because of them, so they're always our why.